Greetings everyone and welcome to Pacific Drive. Now this is going to be a different kind of a video for me. What we're going to look at is a specific quirk that my vehicle has and how to deal with it. Now this is not something I picked up on. Last night during the stream, this is something my viewers picked up on. So let's just talk about what is going on with uh, my vehicle over here. So we're going to jump in. All right, we're going to do the old parking brake, kick the ignition on. So what is happening on occasion is that when I reverse, the hood pops open. So let's just see. Oh, didn't happen. I'm guessing there's no problem at all. So let's just go back in here. Let's stop and then let's revert. Oh, there it goes. All right, let's just pop back into place. Like I said, it doesn't happen all the time, but it does happen. All right, let's try reversing again. Yeah, nothing, nothing, nothing. Maybe it's a every other time. All right, stop, backing up, and there we go. Obviously, this is something that could be a problem, so we're going to have to look into this. All right, so back into park, turn the ignition off. So our wonderful vehicle has an issue. Let's see what we can do about resolving it. Now, the way you resolve a quirk is you go over to the Tinker Station. So let's just jump right in. So this is where you diagnose your quirk. Essentially, you're trying to guess it if you're not really sure, and you do have a limited number of tries. Otherwise, I guess maybe the quirk becomes permanent. Now, in this case, it is pretty clear what's going on. Now, in order to move around, you're going to be using the WASDA keys. All right, in this case, we're going to do car, and then I'm going to hit D to move on to the next category. And then we're going down to moves backwards. So, in other words, that's what I'm doing. Now, what actually happens? So, we're going to go down to hood. And then we're going to go D. And then we're going to say opens. And once again, we're going to do D. Now, it says I have eight possible guesses. But in this case, it is kind of clear what's going on. So, I'm just going to hit the old enter. And it's going to diagnose. And it says correct diagnosis. Okay, so that's fine. It didn't take a guess away from me. Now, it doesn't actually show you on the screen, but you're supposed to hit E. Well, actually, it's kind of hidden at the top there. All right, so here we go. We're going down one, and it's telling me that it needs mechanic kit. Yeah, it's really hard to see. I have no idea why they made this very hard to see. But it does say mechanic kit, and if you look over on the right, it's actually telling you it needs two of them. So we're going to break out of this, and we're going to make a couple of mechanic kits. So let's get over here. Where am I? Okay, there's two right there. So we're going to craft one, and then we're going to craft two. All right, so I actually have, I have one in my hand, and one is over here. All right, so let's go back to this, and we're going to hit E. Now, we can just skip this screen and go right to E again. I don't know why that pause covers up that menu item at the top uh, right there. It just doesn't seem to make a lot of sense for that to happen. Anyway, we're going to hit E, and then we're going to go back down to this one. And as you can see, it still wants the mechanic kits, two of them. So I got that one selected. I'm just going to hit uh, the Enter key on that. Fix Quirk, yes, and hit it again. And then it gets psychedelic, and it says Resolved. All right, so let's just pop out again. Let's just jump right into the vehicle. Now, remember, it was doing it like every other time, so we're really going to have to test this guy out. All right, so backing up. And there was nothing. Let's just drive in again. And then backing up. Ooh, it's not opening. We'll try one more time just to make sure. Yep, no problem. Okay, so that quirk has been resolved. And like I say, I give full credit to my viewers on stream for identifying the problem. All right, so that is a quirk fixed in my vehicle. That was actually an easy one to diagnose because it was pretty darn consistent and you can actually just do it right in the garage. All you have to do is back up and it was kicking it up. But you basically, you see what you do in terms of uh, using the Tinker Station here. If you know what the problem is, you basically use the first two categories to identify what you're doing. 
and the second two to basically what has happened. In our case, it was car moving backwards, hood opens. And then, of course, if you are correct in it, then you would hit the E and you would get the fix and it would tell you exactly what you need to do in order to resolve it. And of course, you see those mechanic kits are now gone because they were used to fix the quirk in the vehicle. Anyway, just a short video in terms of quirks. Hopefully, we don't have too many more in the future. Anyway, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. Maybe say something in the comments for the Great God algorithm. And of course, subscribing is a great way to show your support. So thank you very much for your attention. I really appreciate it. And play games because games are fun. See ya.